So I'm going to try and take a photograph. I can't really use camera because I just show it too much. Just Which press button them. do I press? Yeah, the big, that one yeah, or that yeah, one? Yeah, the big, big white, white one. Big white one. There you go. Sounds like you took one. Oh, does it? Yeah, I've got one. Makes you look awful. <laughs> Thanks. My name's Sarah Howden and I'm 74 years old. Hello! I first noticed my tremor probably about 30 years ago. My head was starting to shake and then gradually I realised that my hands were shaking. The difficulty is lifting the cup to drink from it because if I try and lift it up, it just goes everywhere. Over the sink? No, well, one hand. Use the second at some no. point. I have to use two. Yeah. It's just really been in recent years that it's got much worse. And each time I see her, I become more aware of things that she finds very difficult. Just for instance, trying to use a mobile phone has now become, you know, extremely difficult for my mother. Go into the phone, that's fine. Go into where? The phone. What do you mean? The picture of the phone. That one. And then from there, you can see oh, at the bottom, contacts. contacts. I've noticed it's taken a bit of her confidence away. Um, she doesn't have the same attitude of, this can't be that hard, I'm just gonna get on with it. She finds it stressful and uh, she tries to avoid confronting it. Gradually over the years both the tremor in my head and my hands has got worse. I now have a tremor in my voice and slowly I'm finding it more difficult to speak. I first became aware of gyro gear through my son, Richard. It was nice to know that there were people who were working on a tremor problem. I was feeling powerless to help my mother and I just stumbled through the internet on um, this uh, firm that was being spun out of Imperial. I'm glad I'm working with Jara Gear because nobody else seems to be able to really help at all. I've always felt encouraged by nice friends down in Devon and my family are lovely. You keep going around one person taking each brick and then eventually someone will make it fall and they're the loser. If it gets stuck you can leave it and switch to a different one. Whoa. The fact that there's some hope that technology will keep up with the degeneration, that more things will be possible for her as her shape gets worse. You see the speech bubble in blue, light blue. Yeah. Um, and if you know, if very soon she can have one of these permanently, that'll obviously be an enormous help, and she'll be able to do a lot more than she can at the moment. Here we are. The day has been very hot. You could have just told me, you know. <laughs> it's helped me think that it's not a case of waiting around, waiting for my mother's life to deteriorate to the point of being unlivable. I would like to have a glove for each hand to help me carry on my life with less of a tremor. So, yeah, I got unlucky, but hey, could be worse. Oh, Whoa. My. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs>